Okay, welcome back. And before we show you the piano itself, I'll show you a couple other things. Now, you can buy the piano with this one box, just like I just opened. And I've seen that pretty much everywhere for about $200. Uh, roughly $200. You get the piano, the sustain pedal, the power supply, um, and you're good to go. Now, you do get... On this, that came, comes with a piece of paper, it says, explains, that you get um, your Williams piano includes free software for learning to play piano. Go to www.mccarthypiano.com slash Williams to register your piano using the serial number. Set up and confirm your McCarthy Music account. Select your free songs and begin playing by downloading the McCarthy Music application and logging in with your credentials. Um, by the way, this is not real super well made. It's plastic. I don't know if you can see that. We'll get to that in a minute. Let me show you this first. This is the Musician's Gear KBX-1 stand that comes for holding up the piano itself. Comes in three pieces, and I see there's some instructions in here, so hopefully you don't put it together wrong and drop the piano on the floor. And there's some things you have to do to put it together. We'll do that in a minute. Okay. And then there's it also comes with put this over here. If you can't see where I'm talking. It also comes with this bench. Now, that stand, while I'm sure it's probably adequate, looks kind of cheap. This bench, on the other hand, that's just a little cardboard that's stuck to it, does not look cheap. This thing looks awesome, actually. You just take your height, just lock that in, and you're good to go. It seems really, wow, it's really comfortable actually. <laughs> and it seems, and it's really solid. So, I'm kind of surprised. Maybe when I put the stand together, it'll be fine. Uh, I don't know if you can see that. Let me see if I've got the camera right. Yeah. Um, but this is cool. This is, this was worth the extra money all by itself, really. All right, put this out of the way. And bring the camera over, show you the other things, let you hear the piano. So, let's see here. Forgive me if you haven't uh, figured out yet that I'm crazy. Um, you want to watch some of the other videos. I lost my mind. Okay, those are the instructions for putting the table together. All right, so <clears throat> this thing has many, many modes to it because it's a digital piano. Um, and that means you can plug in earphones. The box came kind of smashed up. Musician's Gear MG900 Studio Headphone. If you're, if you're just a beginner, you might not know, but you see these things on sale. On um, stupid deal of deal of the day at musicians friend, um, quite often, and they're actually they're not horrible headphones at all. Let's see if they're yeah. I mean they, you know they're they're full earphones. They're completely they're padded, and uh, and they work quite nicely. I have. I got lots of ear, earphones of various types and sizes that I've checked out. Uh, we'll get into that again later. <clears throat> Sorry, spending too much time off camera. All right. Um, it also comes with, again, smashed. This the box that has the accessories in it is a brown cardboard box. Um, and it got smashed, but the other things that are in there are all in boxes. 
those headphones for example and they're fine uh, this is the software comes with um, my serial number installation instructions so this is what I'm going to use to start learning how to play piano hopefully and let's have a listen so um, it has an, a metronome there's two speakers They're, they go quite loud let's, well, let's turn the stupid metronome on all right. Um, it has Bluetooth for demo. There's a chorus function, reverb. Then the, the modes are piano, electric piano, organ, pad, bass, and then you can split it. And so let's hear what it sounds like. So piano. Let's see. Middle C. I'm, I know enough to be dangerous. All right. So then middle C. Whoa. By the way, you you read a lot when you're researching pianos. You read a lot about weighted keys. These are full-size keys. They're called semi-weighted. And I have to say, I, I mean, I've, I don't play piano, but I've, you know, messed around with a keyboard on a piano, the keys. And I would say that's partially weighted. I would say that's, it isn't not weighted. It's also Also senses how hard I'm pushing on it, which like a real piano would. So that's with the sustain pedal on. Middle C. Alright, so middle C. And then one, two, three is a chord. So there's a chord. piano. That's with the sustain pedal. This is without the sustain pedal. Wait for it. Okay. All right. Pad. I don't know what pad is. This is without the sustain pedal. This is with the sustain pedal. I'm still holding the sustain pedal. Now I'll let go of the sustain pedal. All right, bass. Not very loud. Okay, and split. Let's do a split and electric piano. This is bass. Okay. Um, <coughs> 200 bucks just for that. For a little bit more, you can get the really nice bench, decent decent headphones. I've used them before. Um, you get the music lesson software um, on a CD, so you're not gonna have to pay for at least some of the lessons. And um, and it's a digital piano, so it's got all these extra modes, function modes, 
A sharp tuning, C sharp voice volume. Ah, you can turn up the bass probably. D sharp layer volume. You probably can't see that, but each of the piano keys, when you're in um, function mode, how do you get in function mode? I'm not sure. Probably tells you in here. Uh, time signature, MIDI channel, MIDI panic, metronome volume. Oh, good, because that, that was loud. Uh, local on off. Soft velocity, normal velocity, hard velocity, split volume, transpose, transpose. That's a biggie. Auto power on off. Mod function on off, ah, there you go, and middle C. So that's all in the lower part of the keyboard down here. Uh, A2, mod FX on off. All right, I will read the manual and figure out how to use some of this stuff. I will take some of the lessons and we'll come back and we'll see what we got. But you know what, if you're gonna learn piano, you don't want one of those rinky-dink toys. This is an 88 key, full-size keyboard, partially weighted, semi-weighted, whatever they call it. It's not fully weighted, but it's not not weighted either. I can You can tell that it's weighted. Uh, turn off split, I'll go back to piano. So. How the heck can you go wrong? This thing sounds awesome to me. Now this is the Legato 3. I understand the Legato not as good. Um, they have a uh, 800 number here, 888, to call toll free or visit uh, williamspianos.com. Uh, if there's a problem with your thing, Bluetooth, this explains something about Bluetooth wireless. Uh, Williams iOS app controls piano settings. Oh, cool because I have an iPad, so that works. Plays accompaniment rhythms and songs and records your performance. Includes McCarthy Music Piano software and a free live remote lesson. Connect to apps on your iPad, iPhone, Android, or computer. Ah, Android also, and your computer. There's a USB connection in the back so you can plug in. You need one of those funny, um, the old style, kind of square USB cables they used to use on printers. I don't know if they still do. Uh, but you can buy those. Go to Amazon, you'll find one. They're very inexpensive if you don't have one. I'm going to put together the um, the stand for the piano real quick, and I'll show you that. This is a nice piano. All right, hold on. I'll be right back. Drive you crazy some more. <laughs> 